Well, the time is 9.06 now, and let's take another live look outside. Hard to kind of see that live look outside. It is uh, very rainy still this morning here in the New Orleans metro area. We're joined now by Quaylen Murphy, and we've heard all this talk about the rain and how much it's been falling lately. I mean, do, are we worried about flooding at this point, or is it all kind of moving out? No, the spots that are flooding are the spots that really captured a whole lot of rain early on this morning. Morgan, so any additional rainfall won't be too heavy, but it'll be causing maybe some nuisance flooding for those areas ongoing until we start and stop getting that accumulation. Here's a look right now. Satellite and radar showing where the rainfall is still light to moderate. Certainly over Lake Pontchartrain. We still have some moderate rainfall over Metro New Orleans and back into our river parishes, certainly over Saint Bernard to up into Lake Bourne. Then you catch a break with some lighter showers from Lafouche, Lower Lafouche into Lower Jefferson and also into Plaquemines with some spotty storms still hanging around around uh, near Homa as well. Those strongest storms have now pushed off shore. So the marine warning that was in place for the coastal waters of southeast Louisiana has ended. Still marine warning right around the pass to those offshore waters. We have the frontal boundary still out west and so until the front comes through, which won't be until later on today, we want to keep that chance for scattered showers, isolated storms this morning and then turning to more isolated shower and storm potential into the afternoon. So here we are by two o'clock and most of us will be looking at dry conditions with even some peaks of sunshine. But if you have outdoor plans today, much of the day, at least for the remainder of the afternoon, should be on the dry side. But we can't count out a chance for a stray shower or storm even this afternoon. So what that means is if you're outdoors, I know there are lots of things happening today. Uh, if you're outdoors, you have to make sure that you have a safe place to get to. If you hear thunder, don't wait it out. Don't chance it. Just go ahead to your uh, car or find a safer building to be in until the storm pass. It won't last too long. Overnight, we'll get some clearing going and then eventually back to some sunshine that's coming our way. More on that in just a bit. Morgan, back to you. All right, sounds good, Quaylen. Thank you. And hey, if you haven't yet, now is the perfect time to download the WDSU mobile app. There you can stay up to date on this severe weather and track what's happening in your area with our live radar. It is free to download for your iPhone or Android device.